Hi there, quick little video about uh, Battery 4. A little tip, uh, basically um, for when you're building uh, your own kits. Um, you can bump into a problem, or something that's not all that easy. And I got a nice little uh, workaround there. So I'd like to show you how, or a nice little tip. I mean, it is a workaround, but it, it is a, this, this is a tip. So um, let's say, um, <coughs> let's, let's act like uh, you built this, you know, on the standard uh, range of columns and uh, keys, notes and octaves actually, actually, rows and columns, whatever. So, um, you, you know, all of a sudden, ah oh, shit, I need another, uh, I need another column. Now actually we want another row. Ball. Doesn't matter, but anyhow, doesn't matter what you do. Um, I want to show the row because that's easier. So um, yeah, you go further. You know, you you load your sounds. Of course, you listen to them first normally, but we're not going to do that now. I'm just going to show you. Uh, oh, that's the same one. Well, who cares? Well, now you see the problem you walk into. This, I hit it, C1. This one, C1. That one, also C1. Everyone's gonna be C1. Uh, ev every, uh, yeah, everyone. So that's, uh, that kind of sucks. You have to change it manually. And, yeah, every time, every time uh, with your mouse, this and that. Does it work nice? So what I would advise is when you start building a kit is just um, you know, load the kit from which you know it's big. Yeah, so this, this one is bigger. This has um, two extra rows. So you know you just go from here. You can all cut them for example. But you don't you don't have to do that. But then you got a nice clean look and it's all blank. Uh, you can uh, of course you can just um, just replace them. You know, and then the key range is all good. And especially where we bumped into this problem earlier with adding row. You won't have that problem now because it's already mapped. Look, C5, E5 you see, so that's... C5, C6. Oh. So you know, they're already... Uh, whoa. Pre-mapped, so... Um, so that's kind of nice. I, I think this is a faster, yeah, a good workaround. It would be nice if you expanded the row and it would be automatically uh, change the key. But that's not the case. So yeah, since that's not the case, for now I think this is will be a good uh, a good workaround. So yeah, I hope you understand. If you got any questions, uh, just ask. If you have a comment, leave a comment. If you want to sub subscribe for more uh, for more videos, I do more tutorials. Actually, this is just a little tip. I will do. Uh, I got some more tips and stuff. So I will. Um, yeah, I will show them all to you. I just started with it, but um, but the content will be uh, expanding. So um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope it helped you out. And thanks for watching. Alright. Bye.